Welcome back everyone for our first peek at South America. With the activities we have in store, you'll be able to explore every part of Mexico from the skies to the underwater adventures. So let's start off by riding the Copper Canyon zipline. The Copper Canyon zipline held the world record as the longest zipline until 2018, but it is shy of its competitor by only 50 feet, so don't shrug this one off just yet. The second longest, highest, and fastest zipline in the world is in the Copper Canyon Adventure Park. This zipline is part of a system consisting of seven ziplines and two suspension bridges. Those who dare to take the leap will experience a vertical drop of just under 1,500 feet as they travel over the fields of a local community. Besides ziplining, some other activities in the park include a trip in a cable car and scaling the wall of the canyon. All of these activities allow you to enjoy the beauty of the canyon while experiencing an insane adrenaline rush at the same time. Next up, cliff diving. Cliff diving is a sport that will provide you with an incredible adrenaline rush and high energy adventure. Mexico is home to three incredible diving locations. There are locations specifically for professional divers to jump in Acapulco. And if you chicken out, you can always just watch the show from below. There's also a 90 foot deep sinkhole filled with water in the Yucatan and lastly, the oceanfront outcroppings in Mazatlan. From cliff diving to scuba diving in the underwater art museum. Mexico's underwater art museum is located in Cancun. The threatened sea life in the surrounding area gave birth to the museum's mission of integrating art and the natural environment. And as time goes on, their exhibit of an underwater sculpture is able to support more and more aquatic life. You can take a glass bottom boat trip out to explore, but if you would rather be up close and personal, the museum offers a scuba diving class in order to get certified right before you jump in. Okay, let's take a break from diving and go hiking at Pico de Orizaba. The highest mountain in Mexico and third highest in North America is an intense journey throughout all temperatures and terrains. Starting early in the morning will allow you to see the sunrise at the summit and check out the glorious shadow the mountain casts over the plains below. Make sure you plan in advance as this isn't your regular walk in the woods, but it also isn't a view that you'll find every day. Our next can't miss adventure is swimming with the whales in the Sea of Cortez. Each year, the California gray whales migrate to the Sea of Cortez for mating and birthing rituals. This is the best time to get up close and personal with these incredible animals. The waters here are so safe from predators and the whales are so accustomed to being around humans that not only can you take a boat trip out to see them, but many guides will take you right out into the water face to face with these marine beauties. From the Sea of Cortez to taking a trip through the Lacandon jungle. In Mexico's deep south is the Lacandon jungle home to indigenous Mexican communities that hold tight to their traditions and ancestry. Taking a tour through this incredibly rich natural and cultural region can be done in so many different methods such as kayaking, rafting, or hiking. Now for a little adrenaline pump, let's ride the rapids in Veracruz. The Veracruz rapids are not for the faint of heart with class three and four whitewater rapids to take on. Approximately 40 plus rivers that run through the central coastal state with varying degrees of adrenaline pumping rapids, breathtaking scenery, and lots of side trips for hiking and sightseeing of ancient ruins. It's the perfect vacation for any adventure seeker. Next, on to one of the most interesting and diverse things to do, swimming in cenotes. These natural sinkholes were once a source of water for the Mayan people, and today serve as a popular spot for visitors to swim and dive. There are not one, not two, but just about 7,000 cenotes, all providing different experiences and activities. For example, Tulum's Car Wash Cenote. This swimming hole once served as a sort of natural car wash for local taxi drivers, 
But today, the cars have been replaced by tourists who come for the incredible experience and history. Cenote Sarado is another cenote, but it is still considered sacred to local Mayans. Because of this status, swimming is not permitted, but photography is, and you do not want to miss out on these views. Keep in mind that the Yucatan Peninsula is the only place in the world you can find these unique pools, so it's a must add to your Mexican vacation. Next up, in Mexico, you must embrace your inner tourist at Xochimilco. Xochimilco is covered in canals that serve one main purpose today, carting drinking tourists around in colorful boats while you let loose and have a memorable time. Hire a boat, pack a cooler full of snacks and drinks, and grab some friends, and you'll be able to kick back and have a delightful time in Xochimilco. You can either pay for a ride up and down the river on a shared boat, or rent an entire boat with a group, all affordable thrills you do not want to miss. You can also join a tour in which you explore other parts of the city. Our next absolute can't miss activity is admiring Mexico City from above. The observation deck of Torre Latino Americana is home to the best view of Mexico City. Being on top of this tower allows you to appreciate the city for all it is. The Torre Latino Americana is a very affordable thrill and definitely a must add to your list of things to do in Mexico City. Now let's go from the skies to freshwater cave diving in the Yucatan Peninsula. Cave diving isn't for the faint-hearted, weak swimmers, or anyone who gets claustrophobic. However, if you can get past the idea of being sandwiched between one solid rock and another, then you are in for a real treat. Freshwater cave diving in Mexico is incomparable. You enter a vast hidden world riddled with cave systems, crystal clear water, and various sea wildlife. Okay, here's one last one for the real thrill seekers. Bungee jumping in Los Cabos. The wild landscape of Baja California does not disappoint with forests to deserts and the crystal clear blue waters. So what better way to see it than free falling from the sky? The bungee jump in Los Cabos is located in the wild canyon, meaning you'll get incredible views of the Sea of Cortez before you make the jump. For decades, the Sea of Cortez was revered as one of the world's most incredible marine ecosystems. So seeing it from above must be unforgettable. The views of the Sea of Cortez take us to the end of this video. If you liked any of the locations, drop a comment, like, and subscribe for our upcoming crazy adventures.